Hey everyone, welcome to TechWired. In this video, we are going to see problem number 997, find the town judge. So here we need to find whether there is a judge exist or not. Okay, so a judge is a person who is trusted by everyone and the judge himself will not trust anyone. Okay, if there is no such person we have to return minus one. We will see the logic and the solution in this video. Now let's dive into the solution. So this is one of the examples that is given in the leak code. So what we are going to do is we are going to have two list. We are going to first initialize with zeros. Okay. So these zeros list has been created using n plus one. So what we are going to do is we are going to keep track whether the person is trusted by everyone and the person is not trusting anyone. So what I mean that. So for example, I'm going to show you the logic now. We will first take one and three. Here one trusts three. Okay. One trusts three. So I'm going to increase by one here. Okay. And one is trusted by three. So I'm going to increase three here. Okay. Increase by one. Okay. Next, I have two and three. Here, I will take the second index. Okay. Here. Here, two is the person who trusts, okay? And he trusts three. So I'm going to increase in the index three by one. Okay? Now we can see that number three is trusted by everyone. N minus one. Can you guys see that? And three does not trust anyone. That is zero. So we need to return three. So why we are creating n plus one lists here? Because just to avoid the index. Okay, we are just avoiding this index. We are just considering this part from one. Okay. Now I also show with guys with the another example. So here we have one and three. Here the person one trust three okay that's what it is here the one trusts three so i'm going to increase in the index one so one is the person who trusts okay trust the other person so i'm going to increase it by one and i'm go also going to increase by one the trusted person here one trust three i'm going to increase increase in the index 3 here next 2 comma 3 here 2 trust 3 i'm going to increase by 1 here and again i'm going to increase by 1 in the index 3 okay now 3 comma 1 here 3 trust 1 i'm going to increase by 1 here and I'm also going to increase in the index 1. Since this is the person who is trusted by the other person. Here we keep track of the, the person who trusts others. Here we are keeping track of the, the person who is trusted by others. Okay. We could clearly see that there is no 0 for any of the index. Okay, we have to consider it from here. We could clearly see one has and one in either. We need to have zero in both the lists. Okay, sorry, we need to have um, zero here and we need to have n minus one people here for either any of the one index. Then that person is the judge. 
if there is no such person in this case we are going to return minus 1 okay now we will see the code so initially we are going to create the trusts list okay I'm going to create trust list of n plus 1 okay n plus 1 n plus 1. Also, I'm going to create a trusted by list. Trusted by. Okay. n plus 1. Of 0 why we are get creating n plus 1 just to avoid the index 0 here since we know that question starts from 1 to n so we are going to just create avoiding in order to avoid the zeroth index okay now I'm going to run a for loop okay I'm going to increment I'm going to increase the particular index value by 1 whenever I see and I'm going to in also increase the trusted by list as well next I'm going to check since we know we have 1 to n range I'm going to start from 1 and n plus 1 range okay then if the person is trusted by everyone we need to check whether the person is trusted by everyone n minus one okay and also that person that particular judge the particular person should not trust anyone it should be zero if we see that such type of person we need to return that person i here okay if there is no such person we need to return minus one cool now we will run the code oops it should be trust now it should work oh here as well trust as you guys see it worked thank you for watching this video please like and subscribe this will motivate me to upload more videos in future and also check out my previous videos and I've also given the solution for this particular problem in the description. You guys can check that one as well and keep supporting. Happy learning. Cheers.